Simon Corla. I have absolutely no hesitation in expressing my full confidence from my colleague Simon Harris, the Minister for Health. Once more, the latter day Robespierre's of Sinn Féin have rolled their shabby guillotine into this chamber demanding a head. For a party that's never had to govern here and ran from government in the north, it's the easy thing for them to do. But you want to contrast that with my colleague, Minister Harris. He has taken with relish one of the most challenging portfolios in the government and he has tackled it admirably. I know for a fact when this Taoiseach was appointed, he gave Simon three key tasks to lead out on the repeal of the eighth uh, referendum, to get the public health alcohol bill through the Oireachtas, and to implement Slauncha Care. And to help to repeal the Eighth Amendment, Simon brought a blend of passion, empathy and logic to successfully make the case for repeal and contributed significantly to the outcome of the referendum. Despite huge pressure from various lobby groups, he successfully brought the alcohol bill through the Oireachtas in a country that has a harmful relationship with alcohol. He led out to change effects that will change the culture and the habits of consumption surrounding alcohol for generations to come. And similarly, he's tackling the third task, the implementation of Sláinte Care. I know most of the House supports Slauncha Care, but I'm much more confident that it's actually going to happen with this minister at the helm who's shown courage, focus and commitment. It's easy to call for heads, Las Concorla, however, to actually achieve anything requires more substantive qualities. It requires courage and ability to be able to take on the big challenges and the vested interests and not run away. That's what distinguishes Simon Harris with those proposing this motion today, and that's why it's easy for me to have confidence in him.